Welcome to an introduction to SageLine 50 Accounting. In this first podcast, we're going to show you how to set up a company in the accounting system. Let's first of all open SageLine Accounting. It starts with an opening screen and it will give us three options. We can either open our company's data, open practice data, or open demonstration data. We'll just say to OK for that. And in this case, what we're going to do is add a company. So we are given some choices, and it says Welcome to SageLine 50 Accounts. We can set up a new company, we can use an existing company, or we can restore data from a backup file. Our interest is setting up in a new company, which is already selected. So we take Next, and we start by entering the company's name. Which we will call Cano Gardens, and we will have an address 10 High Street, and we'll have any town and a postcode of BB57UU. We want a telephone number. next. Now we are asked to select the business type and for your assessments most of these will be for a limited company so we will have a limited company. Select that and go to next. We are asked when we start the financial year. We will do a typical year. We will start in April and we will leave it at 2012. So that's the start of our financial year. Is our company VAT registered? Yes and we will need a VAT registration number and we're going to use a standard VAT scheme and we're going to put in the current standard rate of VAT which is 20% and we'll go to next we'll ask for the currency that our company is going to use which is pound sterling that's fine so we go to next we now have the opportunity to check our data first of all where it's going to be stored it's company number five do we want to share the folder? No. Cano Gardens, it's a limited company. Our financial year from April to March, standard VAT, pound sterling. We will now create the company. We'll now copy those details in. And what it's going to do is set up a series of files, which will be for the new company. And those files will basically be for the ledgers and for the day books. It's now copying the reports. And it will go through this procedure of creating the company every time you try and set up a new company. It's now creating the data files. You can see it's rather a large number of data files for each company. It has now completed our configuration and we should now have a new company. It opens our company. It has a welcome screen and if we look at the top we can now see that that is for Cano Gardens and if I just look at our company preferences we can see that we have Cano Gardens, 10 High Street, Anytown, BB57U and so on. Those are our details, our VAT number and we are on standard VAT. So we will click on OK, we will accept those and that's all we need to do to set up or create a company for SageLine accounts. So at that point we will stop, that's our first short podcast.